What's up everybody? Chris Galt here, Healthy Living with Chris Galt. Today we're going to talk about vision boards. And you don't know what they are? Well just stay tuned. Alright, and make sure you watch the full video and that way you'll get the full benefit from this because it all kind of ties together and that way it will give you some tips that you can go and take action on. And remember Newton's law that a body at rest stays at rest, but a body in motion stays in motion unless a force is acted upon them. Meaning basically that if you want to make changes in your life, you have to actually change something in your life. So make sure that you take some action on this and you'll actually get something out of the video, which is why you're watching it, I would assume. So if you don't know what a vision board is, it's basically just a graphic depiction of your goals for a certain period of time. And I like to do them for the year because it's very, it's very clear cut. I know it's time is man-made, but basically it does help out to actually do it that way for me. And I, I just do it in a year. So this is my, and I'll talk a little bit about my vision board for 2020, which is the one for the last year. And this is what it looks like. And you can see my main thing. The only thing I really hit was I hit over a hundred thousand views for the year. So uh, that I feel grateful for. So I want to thank you all for supporting this channel because I was able to hit that goal. The 10,000 subscriber uh, mark, I was a little short. I have a, a little bit less than 5,000 subscribers are right around there. And I didn't hit the $3,000 a month. I think I didn't really understand how much you make on YouTube for a certain amount of subscribers and views. So now that I understand that, I'm going to talk a little bit about that you know, next in my next uh, year's one. The other thing I just want to talk about, and then I'm going to get away from this, is uh, my travel one. Of course, with COVID, that really got completely put away. My wife and I had our 30th year anniversary, and we were hoping to go to uh, to the Amalfi Coast, which is over here, and also to Croatia, but obviously. Nobody really traveled in 2020 and it doesn't look like it's gonna be a while, but I'll talk about that a little bit in 2021. So this is basically my depiction, but I'm gonna talk a little bit more when I talk about 2021. So that was 2020. Let me show you 2021. So this is 2021 and you can see again, it's very heavily graphic up. So basically what I do is, is I just use PowerPoint, uh, but you could use almost any software like Microsoft Word or anything like that. And I just go into Google and I just find images of things that are gonna represent goals of mine and I just pop them on. And you can see what I've done is I put in the middle goals for 2021 and then I have four separate quadrants, one for YouTube. This is what I did last year. So YouTube, health coach, which is really more my wife and I help her out, travel and, um, and personal. So if you look at this, my YouTube goal now next year, because now my YouTube channel is starting to, to get bigger. And so now I feel like I can have a bigger dream and you you know, you dream, you might as well dream big, right? So I, I uh, am going for 1 million views in total. So not just for the year, but in total that the channel have a million views. So now that I'm getting close to about 200,000 views, uh, that means that I need a little more than 800,000 views to actually hit that. I want to have 15,000 subscribers. I'm around 5,000, like I mentioned. So it's gonna be a pretty good goal to hit 10,000 more subscribers, but I think I can do it. And I think if I get a million views in that, I can, I, between affiliate marketing and also AdSense and some other things, I think I might be able to get close to $3,000 a month that I wanted to get last year, but I didn't realize you can't do that on just hundreds of thousands of views. You have to do that on millions of views. So uh, I am I'm hoping to do that. Uh, my wife, health coach, uh, this FIBIC doesn't mean much to most people, but it means a lot to her. So I am putting some time in to help her get there and travel. We are definitely going to go to Croatia and Amalfi Coast next year. And there's two reasons why. One, again, it's our 30th year anniversary, which was delayed because we weren't able to travel in 2020. But also I'm turning 60 in April of 2021. So between those two things, those are two big milestones in life that we want to make sure that we go to those two places. And we think that by the summer, it sounds like by the summer, so probably around July, August timeframe, we may be able to travel again uh, now that the vaccine is going out and it seems like we might be able to get past this pandemic 
the summer sounds like about the time it starts to open up. So that's why we have that. And personal, I have, uh, we, our cars are about 13 years old now. We did buy our cars new, we always do, but they're getting a little old and one of them is, has a lot of miles on it. The other one doesn't have a lot of miles on it. So the one that has a lot of miles on it, we probably have to get rid of. So we're looking at probably getting a new car. And I'm gonna talk about that in a minute. But those are our, the, the, the four quadrants that I have. So again, you can put your four quadrants together or you can have three quadrants or you can have no quadrants and you can just throw everything in there. The other thing that I've done is I put a couple of other goals in here that are kind of like crossing the lines. Um, although this is kind of like a personal. So this is just supposed to signify my wife, me and our son, our adult son who lives in a different state. He lives in Colorado, we live in California just that we're, we're healthy and strong going into 20, all through 2021. This is a picture of my son, because now he's talking about going back to college and perhaps getting his business or accounting degree. So I'm hoping he does that. And this is just me, because everyone who knows me, first of all, there's two things in this one. This is, one is, I really want to make sure that me and my family and my friends and all everybody, we're all happy. And because it's a much better world if we're all happy. And so that's the smiley face there, is be happy. Uh, the other thing is, as you know, I don't even though I have a challenge with it, is I didn't have any hair on the top of my head uh, a couple of years ago. And what one of the things that started this whole YouTube channel and anti-aging and, uh, and being healthy living was to try to grow my hair back so that I wouldn't let life just take over me, but that I could actually control something of it. Because I'm a firm believer that we're in control of our own destinies and we shouldn't let life happen to us, but we should take control of it. So one thing I wanted to do is grow my hair back naturally. So with through massages and derma rolling and stuff like that, all natural things, I'm not using any chemicals. I was able to grow some of that back, as you can see, I still have a little ways to go. So that signifies growing some more back in 2021. So we'll see what happens and you'll see my videos and you'll see that if I'm actually growing my hair back. So the other things would be, uh, I just threw a couple of little things in here that I think if you're going to put the, together a vision board, and this is not what a lot of people do, but I like to do it, it's just to put little things in, like you got this, and success, and this is positive thinking, just to remind me every time I look at this, this chart that it's going to tell me, yeah, make sure that I keep doing that, because if I'm not positive about things, and if I'm not believing that I got this, then I'm not going to get this. So. This is it, and again, you can do it any way you want. Some people even will just do it on paper, so they'll just get cray paper, and they'll just then go in and, and either print out from Google, or they'll go into magazines, and they'll clip out things, and they'll just paste it up, and they'll put it like as a big collage up on the wall. You can do it that way. I always have, I have this by my desk, so I make sure that it sits there so that every time I sit down, I see it. And so that's what I would recommend is that you have it in a place you could see all the time and put it together and follow it. And I think that it will actually, you'll actually benefit from it. All right, so I'm just wondering, you know, if you got anything out of the video, are you gonna put together your own vision board? I really do recommend you do, but please let me know in the comments below if you're going to. And maybe you could put in there like what are some of your goals are for 2021, it would be really great to see that. It also helps you out to get that out into the world because that way you'll probably be more held accountable and you might go after them more. So, you know, pop all that into the comments below. That would be great. If you have any other ideas on how to put together a vision board that I left out, make sure you share those in the comments too because that way we can all learn from each other. So that would be great if you can do that. And if you like the video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. And that way that really recommends YouTube or lets YouTube know to push this video out to other people so that they can learn from it too. So make sure you do that. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel and ring that bell notification. And that way you'll be notified every time I drop a healthy living video. And currently I will drop them every Thursday and every Sunday. So that's two a week. So make sure that you do that. And if you know anybody who can use healthy living videos like this one, make sure you share this video and the channel with them so that they can join in on all the fun. For more tips on living a happier, healthier life, two videos are gonna pop up right now and you can click on any of those videos and you can continue your happy, healthy living journey. And I'll see you all soon, everybody. 